For years now, we've heard and reported on the long-term effects that playing football can have on kids and adults. Tonight, a Bay Area man is leading the charge in how kids practice on the field, pushing for the state to keep them safe. Our Vanessa Ariza caught up with him and those behind his efforts at River Ridge High School. And she has more on a new piece of equipment players will now wear during weekly practices. This part is the front. You snap it inside your face guard and then strap it and tighten it up in the back. Monday's afternoon football practice at River Ridge High School was a little different than before. Players donning a new look, but more importantly, an added layer of protection to their helmets. Get the Guardian caps on, meet me at the 40 yard line. You are taking a look at the new Guardian caps. If you've watched the NFL's preseason practices, they may look familiar. The pros putting these foam protectors over their helmets to reduce impact. And now it is being brought to high schoolers like Logan Howard. I feel like it's going to help us out a lot because everyone's going to go 100% now knowing that they have extra protection. I love the game of football. I played the game of football in high school, played the game of football in college. It's all thanks to this man, Reagan Weiss and his team members with the organization The Hub that provided these caps. He knows all too well the damage the high impact game can have well after graduation. It just spoke to me. I played college football, played high school football, actually played high school at River Ridge here as well. and. Um, I suffered many, many uh, concussions over the course of my career um, to the point to where it affected my speech. I had hallucinations. Breaking it down, these helmets cost less than $50 a piece. Reagan says that is a small price to pay when it comes to these football players' mental and physical longevity. Go. You got to understand, these, some of these runners are coming at you 20, 24 miles an hour at full hit. That's an extra little set, little extra oh, shock absorber. The biggest thing is being able to keep our kids safe and then being able to make sure that we can have them on Friday nights. Weiss says it doesn't end here at River Ridge. His goal is to make these protectors a statewide mandate. At River Ridge High School, Vanessa Ariza, ABC Action News.